I have been through a lot the last few months. I can no longer eat, talk, move on my own. My breathing is a chore and I weigh 84 pounds. For the past two weeks, you've been reading about a bad break. Today, I consider myself the luckiest man on the face of the earth. Basically, that you have a disease, it's going to get worse, and we don't understand the cause of it. Sometimes you meet somebody in your life who you, you feel is, is doing something that's, that's far greater than who they are, and to me, Steve is one of those people. I've spent close to two of the last three months in the hospital. Since being home, I have little energy. It's hard most days to get out of bed. Despite that my spirit is not broken, and I will not let my quick deterioration discourage me from staying positive. I have learned to truly cherish every moment of every day as we all should. The greatest gift I received through all of this is the unconditional and fearless love from my hope. So that's when he was kind of like, you don't have to stay with me. If this is what it turns out, you don't have to stay. Just never understood why he said that. I would have never left him. You have to have something to live for and you gotta want to live. Uh, so you're keeping a positive attitude uh, about the worst prognosis you can have uh, is very vital. My husband is dying and still thinking about me and how I'm gonna be. Like, it's just beautiful. <laughs>